Welcome back to another Steam Deck related video guys and Valve has just literally released hours ago an update that allows you to add custom boot animations easier than ever before. Now we covered this in a previous video, I'll put a link to it at the top right corner here or top the top left, top right corner up here in the video um, to where you can go watch it but they've made it easier than ever before to do it. Now we're going to walk you through it in this video on how to set this up because there are a couple of steps required but number one is you're going to have to download the update on your settings under system you're going to go into beta participation change the update system update channel to preview and you should get a little update pop up there. Um, you're obviously going to want to install that before we continue with this video but anyways guys this is going to be super exciting. I downloaded a Star Wars boot and animation for mine and i'm excited to show you it and i'm going to walk you through the steps that you need to take to get the setup in your steam deck let's get into it guys i'm blaze 2k please like subscribe click the bell icon down below for more steam deck content if you want to support please click the thanks button down below if this video helped or consider becoming a member by clicking join or become a patreon a patron over at my patreon down in the video description anyways guys let's get into it i'm blaze 2k let's go So guys, as you can see here, it's now way easier to add dope custom boot screens to your Steam Deck. Valve's beta update means that it's even easier to add some action to your startup screen. So basically what this does is it replaces the default boot animation on the Steam Deck, which is the little Steam Deck or Steam logo, right, when you load up the system. Um, and there's a whole community that has popped up on reddit and um, i'm gonna we're gonna take a look at it now before we walk through the tutorial on how to do this um it's called steam deck boot videos now people are basically creating custom steam deck themed um boot animations for the steam deck that will launch as soon as you turn on the system um and basically personalize them to set the steam deck so we've got a star wars one here which is super cool love this one this is actually the one that i installed we've got a neo geo boot video here which is pretty cool so it boots up as if you were booting up the neo geo for the first time <laughs> really cool right look at that that is awesome and then um, we've got another star wars boot animation here people are making people are putting out these cool boot animations guys i'll put a link in the video description where to where you can download these um but obviously we're going to do that in the tutorial video we've even got a back to the future boot intro look at this one Steam Deck, <laughs> 256, over 256, love it. Um, and I also, like I said, I posted a video where I actually showcased some of these. Here's the Futurama one that we talked about. Hell. Looks super cool, dude. Like <laughs> so let's get into it without further ado guys let's talk about this update um oh before i forgot um here's the update information so october 3rd which is yesterday steam deck client beta update boot and boot videos external resolutions and more so custom boot videos steam deck will now look for custom boot and suspend animations and steam ui overrides movies please note that you will need to create the folder first now show you how to do that obviously um and then play custom boot animations in full screen they fixed an issue with startup uh startup haptics um, and they've obviously added a toggle to allow the Steam Deck to automatically control display resolution for external displays. When toggled on, the Steam Deck will automatically adjust the resolution for best performance on higher resolution displays. So guys, without further ado, let's get into this tutorial and let's show you how I did this and how you can get your own custom boot animation set up literally in minutes or seconds if you're fast let's get into it so first things first as i said at the start of the video guys make sure you've downloaded that preview build of the beta from the system settings um you're going to want to switch to desktop mode by going to the power settings and then switch into desktop um once you switch to desktop and get into that um you're going to want to open chrome and visit the reddit page steam deck boot vids um, i'll put a link in the video description for that it's super easy to type in um, find a boot video that you like i chose the star wars one which looks pretty cool um, and there should be links in the comments from the op um, i chose to download the shorter one um, just because I, I wanted it to be a bit shorter it should show up at the bottom of the browser there and then you're going to want to open the file browser click the three little lines at the top right corner and then tick the box that says show hidden files now you're going to want to go down on the left and find home um, from there you're going to tap on deck open up the deck folder you're going to open up the dot local folder um, then share and then from there you're going to go down and you're going to find the folder that says steam and then down again and open up the folder that says steam ui um, 
There we go. And now at this point, you're going to want to right click, create a new folder. And you're going to want to call it overrides. Okay, all lowercase, make sure it's spelled correctly. Um, open it and then we're going to create a new folder again. This time we're going to call it movies, lowercase. Hit OK. Now this is the folder where we're going to store the custom boot animation video that we just downloaded, right? So we're going to go to our downloads folder and we're going to copy, copy the file or just drag it over into the movies folder. And I chose to copy it instead of just moving it, instead of moving it. And now this is the crucial part, guys. You're going to want to right click in your boot video. You're going to want to rename it. Okay. So you're going to rename it and you're going to type in deck underscore startup. And there we go. It's as easy as that. Press hit return. Boom. You've renamed your file. Now what I did was I dragged the Steam, the overrides and Steam UI folders into the quick access panel on the left. Just so I can quickly get in and replace the video if I ever want to do it in the future. You know, and you know, change up my boot video every so often. And then at that point, you're going to want to just restart the system. And voila, you've got your custom boot animation. How cool does that look? Um, see, that wasn't too bad. So guys, there we go. We did it together. Hopefully it wasn't too difficult. And now you know how to set your own custom boot animations to the Steam Deck and make it, you know, make it a little bit more personal to you. Um, but before we go, before we end the video, check out this video that I did on this little bad boy. I'll put a link up on the top right corner of this video to where you can go watch it. Um, basically, it's a fold out bluetooth keyboard and trackpad with three different bluetooth outputs for different devices i use this thing in my steam deck all the time and for situations like this where we're setting up um custom boot animations in the desktop mode being able to navigate with a trackpad being able to type stuff in with a keyboard without having to rely on the virtual keyboard or the the you know the trackpads on the steam deck it makes it so much more easier and easier and um you can take it with you it can you know this keyboard could fit in your pocket and you can take it with you out and about it just use your steam deck as a little mini computer it's awesome so go check out the video and i'll also put the link to this and my favorite steam deck accessories down below in the video description anyways guys i'm blaze okay thank you for taking the time to watch this hopefully it was helpful and if it was please consider clicking the thanks button down below um maybe clicking join becoming a member or becoming a patron over at patreon.com forward slash blaze 2k x link in the description anyways guys i love you and i really appreciate you being here being part of the community please like subscribe comment um and let me know what custom boot animations you are currently rocking on your steam deck and maybe share them over on twitter follow me on twitter as well and maybe send a video with your custom boot animation because i'd love to see it so anyways guys have a great day love you and i'll see you in the next one